Every year, Vector commissions research to explore how the power of technology is being harnessed to support learning. This year, we've decided to present key findings to a wider audience to promote discussion, collect feedback, and stimulate debate. We've identified key themes that underpin some of the main challenges teachers and learners face today, and we've produced a series of films to illustrate how some schools and institutions have responded to these challenges. We've commissioned research to establish how ICT can be used to personalise learning more effectively. Our film shows how one school teacher proactively sought out an ICT solution to help her learners develop the soft skills they'll need to learn effectively after transition. It's really fun. It's a good way to learn. We've also commissioned research to look at how a range of Web2 technologies can be used to support the personalisation of learning. It's, it's really fun and it's easy to use. Sometimes the computer might not want to do what you want it to do, but you've got to learn to live with that sometimes and just pull through it, really. And we've looked at some of the safety and security issues that ensue as a result. All students should work from a level playing field so they can reach their potential in a learning environment that values them. And the film gives a snapshot of a school using practical ICT solutions to do so. I used to prefer drawing my ideas up because I wasn't really familiar with the pro desktop, but when I started getting onto it, I found it easy. I picked it up very easy and started to design a lot more things on it. Online learning offers many and sometimes better solutions to problems that arise in classroom-based teaching environments. And one research study has explored how a funded project has managed to overcome difficulties by providing students with ICT-based learning facilities at home. Like you can email the teacher when you have a problem, if you don't know what you're doing, and then they'll get straight back to you, and then the problem's solved. If we're to create flexible learning solutions to keep students engaged in their learning, we should be able to reduce the number of young people not in education, employment or training. Our research has looked at how ICT can be used to reduce our current NEAT population and to prevent it from growing. You get a good sense of self-achievement self and accomplishment when you realise that you are helping your own community. Five key themes and five short films that present how some schools are addressing the most exciting but challenging issues in the education sector today. By highlighting good practice and conducting thorough research, we hope to inform effective policy and practice for the future. <laughs> <laughs>